Hello and welcome to the video. In this video I will be showing my second Mill Harburg, which is gonna be for the late 12th century. This will be a series just like the Kite Shield, which will span multiple days, even weeks. So the mill I bought again from Ulfbert. So all I gotta do now is degrease it and then tailor it. Also I'm gonna add some things that will make it more 12th century. Just like uh, mittens and uh, the integrated mill coif. But those will come in another video. Now to get all the grease off, I'm going to be very firmly dousing it in uh, the greasing agent. I will have to degrease it in a later time again. Now to clean it in the sink with just some regular water to get all the degreasing agent off and all the uh, leftover grease as well. Now I do find this Harburg has a little bit more stubborn grease as uh, the previous Harburg I've had. But this uh, type of grease doesn't really show as well, it isn't as black as the uh, grease in the other Harburg I have. Now, you do want it to dry fast, so I'm hanging it in front of the fireplace right now. Now the next step is the first step of actually tailoring the Harburg. So now I'm gonna remove some of the excess mail, because the Harburg is uh, too big for me in and of itself. So this time I'm gonna be cutting it uh, straight down the middle, at the front and the back side. This to make sure it does go as symmetrical as possible. So now I'm counting and calculating to determine where the middle is. And then I'll be removing a strip of approximately 8 rings wide on either side.
And yes, the ship is going to be the entire length of the Harburg. This does have a big advantage, as now you have got your rider slit as well. This is the end of day one. The next episode will be about me cutting off and tailoring the arms. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.